Let's go have a look at this bike over here. One of my favorite bikes of all time. This is an S-Works, a specialized S-Works Tarmac SL2 with the Quick Step Team Edition with that BB30 OSBB. That works okay on this one. It's a beautiful bike. Amazing bike. One of my most favorite ones out there. I use this as a city commuter. It's got some road pedals in there. I use mountain bike shoes, but road pedals are fine for sneakers. And uh, we'll cut up M45 on there. More aero. Tight air. We've got tight bars and you've got 38cm bar. So almost my finger span width. And I just wire like narrow bars for traffic is you can just filter through things easier. Wider bars I find good for climbing, etc. But narrow bars for traffic. So I do have a lot of bikes. Never had a driver's license. I ride. I ride everywhere I'm going around. All right. So this is a fantastic bike. Got it near new second hand. Look at the condition of this thing. Got it for $850 Australian as you see it. Dura 7900, very, very nice group set. Still shifts, fantastic. I do have the latest S-Works SL8, and this bike I do prefer. I prefer the SL2, much better than the SL8. The SL2, this bike is lighter than my SL8, even with alloy wheels on there. <laughs> and a heavy seat post, this comes out at lighter than the SL8 S-Works. Man, put some carbon woods on this, lightweight stuff, and then boom, drop it even more. Incredibly stiff bike, super aero. When the wind hits this thing, it just it just blows all around it, especially these skinny, narrow wheels at the front. The air just flows over that so good. When I ride the SL8, the wind catches it, you feel the drag. This bike, pure doper bike. This bike was designed for the best German, Belgium, US dope riders, all right, if you know, you know. Designed for performance. There was competition with Cervelo and Cannondale and Trek, and that was the glory days of, of cycling, pro cycling in its heyday, in its prime time, especially with the product. The product was just amazing back then. The product's going to shit now, if you know, you know. This bike, I just swapped the bars on it, man. I was listening to a Tony Robbins freaking speech while I was doing it, it's just so easy, man. External cables, <laughs> just an absolute dream to work on this bike, absolute dream. The shifting is so freaking crisp. This is a 2009 model. You know, 27 two post, just everything's just easy to work on. Cables, you know, like just bang. Beautiful bike to work on. Dream to work on. Dream to ride. Love this bike. All right, absolute doper bike. Rides so freaking nice, man. Rides so nice. You can flip the stem if you want more stack for the traffic. I've got a bit higher so you can see if the car tops easier. You can slam it down if you want a bit more of an aggressive setup. Whatever you're looking for, you can customize your fit perfectly you can rotate your bars just that supination of the wrist get everything dialed in the latest sl8 you can't do that can you all right this one 27 two post you can put 20 mil offset forward or backwards you know like zero pro it's so easy so cheap stem flip it around change bars everything just it takes minutes to do anything on this bike takes minutes the s works sla tarmac takes hours to do basic shit the bolt i lost the bolt for the seat post and it fell down the frame. It took me God knows how long. First world problems, but I own the bikes. I work on the bikes. I ride the bikes. These bikes are the best. They're so stiff. They're so amazing. They're so durable. And they're so freaking cheap now. If you want one of these bikes, join my coaching group. I'll hook you up with one. This is a size 56. And uh, make me an offer in Adelaide. I'll sell it to you because I just got so many bikes. But this is a killer bike. If no one buys it, I'm happy to keep it. It's a killer bike, man. Giant TCR, also another killer bike from the era. Damn, just, well, there's too many, too many bikes, not enough time to ride them, you know, not enough days in the week. I often ride three or four different bikes in a day just because I like to experience all of them. Amazing bike, man. These are killer. Look at this. That flared Cobra head tube, man. Look at the condition of this 7900 group set. This stuff is killer, man. Absolute killer. No filler. What a bike, man. What an absolute awesome bike. If you know, you know. It, it, it pains me that the riders today don't get to experience bikes like this. These bikes are fucking mint, bro. Fucking mint. If you're an experienced rider, you know what I'm talking about. If you're an experienced mechanic, you know what I'm talking about. If you're an experienced fucking person in life, you know what I'm talking about. These bikes, certified awesome bikes.